Yo, CFC, Reyes Blue, back with another video and this is going to be my Chelsea player ratings for the Chelsea vs Palmeiras Club World Cup final match in the Chelsea 1-2-1, one, one, Champions of the World so you're going to see a gold badge right there, you know, like that I need a whole new top man <sighs> but yep, yeah, player ratings, let's start with the goalkeeper today, Edward Mendy the best goalkeeper in the world congratulations on winning the club world cup with chelsea congratulations on winning the african cup of nations last sunday get me two trophies in one week best goalkeeper in the world come on man and soon enough fam, you can make it all you can make it all three trophies in one month my bro let's do this we'll be liverpool in the carabao cup final come on man and, yep, you had a couple of decent saves. Obviously, you conceded the penalty. And, yeah, you know, clean sheet. But the only thing that matters today is that we got the trophy. And other than that, you had a decent game. And my ring for you today, I'm going to give you a 7.5, man. And then we move on to our centre-backs. Andreas Christensen, you had a very good game today. If I'm honest, man, hold it down a lot down a lot and um if it wasn't thanks to um conceding the penalty like palmares wouldn't have scored so i just have to give you credit and you played a very very good game my rating for you today i want to give you a seven and congratulations on winning the club world cup with chelsea And let me move on to Thiago Silva. And Thiago, bro, leadership, you always have it on display. And also, you nearly lashed out Palmieri's keeper's net, bro, with, you, with a 25 yard shot. Damn, that was close, still was close. But you gave away the penalty, man. You gave away the penalty. And that was just so jarring because then after that, after. Conceding that penalty, like Palmeiras were just on the offensive, man. It was just jarring because sometimes you think to yourself, oh, they're just like one move away from from scoring, and ah, oh, we're just thankful that that never happened in it, that we didn't go 2 1 down. So, yeah, other than that mistake, we had a very decent game as usual. And my ring for you today. I'm going to give you a review of seven. But um, also, then we move on to Antonio Rudiger. Rude, Rude. And my review today, I'm going to give you a 7.5, man. I'll give you a 7.5 because you had a very good game. You wasn't, you wasn't taking no prisoners today. It was clearing up everything, and I won't rely, man. You had a couple of shots off the target, but you just had a very, very good game, and you didn't put anything wrong. So, all I'm going to say is that congratulations on winning the Club World Cup with Chelsea. And my rating for you today, as I said before, I'm going to give you a 7.5. But um, then we move on to our left wing back. Callum Hudson Odoi, he created the goal for the car to for us to take the lead. And what a ball on your left foot as well. Come on, man. Come on, that's what we do. That's what we need to see more consistently, man. Realistically, we have to. But I'm just happy that um, you were able to start. I didn't necessarily think you were going to, but good to see you start and have the impact that you did. But you need to improve on your tracking back, bro. Uh, you don't track back enough. I know that you're just a winger, but obviously in this game, Palmieri is playing higher, playing higher and whatnot. And um, especially in the second half, trying to take the game to Chelsea, he needs you more back, but it's just good that obviously you got the job done. So, my win for you today, I'm going to give you also a, I'm going to give you a 7.5. Maybe 7.5. Actually, no, I'm going to give you an 8. And then, move on to our right wing back Cesar Azpilicueta and realistically it's down to you 
why we won the penalty because you shot and the player handballed it. But if you would never have made the decision to shoot, then we wouldn't have had the situation for us to get the winning penalty for us to win the Club World Cup. And I'm just so happy that you did that. That's big. Because it was so long up until that period. It was so long. I actually thought it was going to go penalty. I was just hoping that it wasn't. But you made sure that that was the case. And then you was holding the ball. I thought it was going to take the pen. Like, I think that's so raw. If you take this and score, that's just different, fam. You know, it's different. But end of the day, you want us, you want us to have the penalty, and now that we have completed football, we won every single trophy there is to win with Chelsea, and you deserve it because, like I said in my match review, you do anything for this team, and that's why you are the captain. You embody what Chelsea is, and what Chelsea loves to do: win, 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 win. You're a born winner. Doesn't matter where you play. You can all put you up top if, if you got to that and you would still try your fullest and maybe that would still be a very good job because you excel in every role that we put you in so far. Whether that's right back, centre back, left back, it doesn't matter where we're in the defence with the ultimate defender. Seven million fan bargain, bargain. Need more players like you, someone that can just do everything. It's just like Mourinho said it. As a point of time, if you had 11 Asper players, you could probably win the Premier League. Because you're just down to rise, you're down for everything. If you bleed Chelsea, oh, it's just excellent, fam. My rating for you today, Asper Quitter, I'm going to give you a 7.5. Big, big, big day, man. Then we move on to the midfield. I didn't go on Kante. I didn't go, you didn't necessarily. Um, have a great have a great game at that. Um in the midfield obviously we was um no couple good pieces but in midfield we was always getting counter attacks, we always left wide open. And I'm not trying to say um and that's necessarily down to you but yeah they just was getting through a lot. But just gonna say that we see um you you are vowed to see and it's happy that you did play because you always provide energy. You can always win a ball back. But yeah, maybe playing in the heat. Obviously you coming back from injury recently. Um, yeah, that's the reason why you're not necessarily you didn't look very up to speed if I'm honest with you, but just gets like that. And my rank for you today, I'm gonna give you a seven. Yeah man, um yeah, we saw let me move up top. <sighs> Mason Mount, Money Mace, you don't really get a rating like that if I'm honest because um well yeah, you um you got subbed off after 31 minutes and I just hope that you um you fully recover. As soon as possible, I guess for the Crystal Palace game or the um real game. We don't need to miss both of them or even one of them, but I hope you get better soon. Congratulations on winning the Club World Cup with Chelsea. Another piece of silverware added to the collection, you know. And yeah, man, I won't give you a rating today, but congratulations again on winning the Club World Cup with Chelsea. Money miss, money miss. And we have Kai Havertz, the boy who won us the Champions League. And the club World Cup, you scored the winning goals. You scored the winning goals, and it takes such balls to take it. Twenty-two years old, scoring the winning penalty. Everyone will say that oh, it's just the club World Cup. We were good. Palmeiras, um, these guys put us through work because they was playing very well throughout the whole game. Counter attacks upon counter attacks. They could have had the other chances. They could have had a lot of other chances, but. For me, or for me, they just they just wasted them. They could have been that, or they could have scored, but they just wasted their chances, and they just made the bad passes and that. So yeah, man. Um, but yeah, Kai Havertz, my bro. He won us the game. So happy now we're the champions of the world. As you said, it sounds so nice. It sounds so nice, man. 
but my reading for you today i'm going to give you a i'm going to give you an eight give you an eight today and then we also have big rom romani lukaku i said in my match preview that hope you score because you need the goals you need to get the goals and you got the goal the 10th goal of the season 10th goal of the season hopefully there's more hopefully we see 20 and honestly i just hope your confidence just rises at this game um he wasn't getting some some service during during the match but you also got to move more man you also got to move more you can't, you can't just be stuck you can't just want the defender to always be on you sometimes move a little lose the defender create more space for other people to run into bro but um but yeah my rating for you today i'm going to give you a maybe a seven but um but yeah man and then we have off the bench christian pulisic replaced me Simon and had a very calm game you could have made it 2-0 had a couple of chances one of them was serious, one of them went wide, and yeah, and then he was moved to the left wing back once some um, Marcus Alonso got taken off in the um, in the second when when extra time. But yeah, man, you had um, a very decent game. He was looking lively, doing your dribbling, getting past one or two players, winning us fouls. But um, yeah, it wasn't wasn't necessarily um, a great game, but. My rate for you today, I'm going to give you a 6.5. He did hit the ball a couple of times, but there's, I felt like he could have scored. But yeah, I'm just going to give you a, actually, I'm going to give you a 7. Give you a 7, man. And then our other substitutes, we got Saul Niguez. You came on, you showed a lot of fight, if I'm honest with you. He was putting your, he's putting your, yourself into challenges that not many people would be putting themselves into using your head and the MC getting it getting it kicked in the head. But you know this but you know but you also know that Chelsea are just trying to um win the game and at that point we probably have um we are winning the match and trying to just close it out. And you're just trying to use your mentality whether that whether you um whether that is you getting um getting hurt for the team just so we can win the club world cup that's just the love you have and that speaks a lot about the world that you are so yeah that was a decent decent performance my rating for you i'm going to give you a maybe a 5.5 if i'm giving you a 6 actually and then more so going to award um a 6 to hakim ziyash um Hakim came in and yeah man you always be able to um, put in your balls. A couple of your balls nearly came off. You see found Sabu with one of them. Kai Havertz could have um scored as well. But um yeah you just had a very decent match. Very decent match. Um but yeah my rate for you is going going to be a six point five. And also then we have Timo Werner and Timo when you came on you gave us a lot of energy the speed you have getting down the line on the left hand side that uh, you create um a lot of threat and a lot of worry for the Palmieri's defenders and there are certain um chances that were created by you it's just that the players are in the right place at the right time to just end it off but a lot of times you was creating um certain opportunities so you're not getting a direct assist or anything, but just creating the space and whatnot. Because the way you play, you always bring others into the game. Just because of um what you attract with your speed, i.e. the defenders from the other team and they just get dragged out of space because you're not just static like a like a Lukaku. So that's just one thing you really you really needed and one thing that possibly helped us to um get the penalty to get the winning goal. My rate for you today, please. I mean, yeah, Verna. I'm going to give you a maybe a six point five, maybe six point five, and then also we have our last substitute, Melanson. Melanson, man, very decent game. 
can come um there's not really too much to say not much, not much happened like that in the second half of extra time you know the say one tackle or so but nothing too major in terms of defense aspects but um yeah my rating for you today i'm just gonna give you a five and then also thomas too cool i don't really want you to drop ziash um i was very impressed that you dropped marcus alonso i like that but also um yeah also we um we we needed um a couple subs earlier i'm honest with you but we just got um just gotta be happy that we won the club world cup and it's thanks to you you have now won the club world cup super cup and champions league in just over a year amazing now the chelsea manager has done this and in too cool forever trust and my rating for you today i'm going to give you a seven yeah chelsea are the champions of the world champions of the world come on that's gonna be it for me for my play ratings video thank you for watching please like subscribe share and comment i'm cfc redis blue and i'm out peace come on chelsea